One of the things that I really enjoy about Leora coming to Camp Lemar, even though the tagline is a special camp for special kids, Leora is not really special here at all. And I mean that in the best possible way. Leora is just one of the campers. We found after the first summer, and Joey was 10 years old, he was able to sit at the table. Um, he learned a lot more self-care, brushing his teeth, um, getting ready for bed without tantruming. Um, transitions were a lot easier because I think the structure of camp is such that, you know, you do it. And it's so fun here for him. Every year she's gone and come back home. Her independence has been amazing. Her will to want to do things on her own, which of course I know I'm guilty of doing things the way I've always been accustomed to doing them and underestimating her at times. Uh, I've seen great growth in Cole, primarily uh, in his independence. So that's one of the things whenever Cole comes back after spending seven weeks, which you know you might think is a long time to send your child, but it actually goes by really quick and it really benefits the child because it takes them time to get used to the camp. And then once they get used to it, they really start having a lot of fun. Just the support that you guys give to the kids and we just know that she's in a safe place and she's going to grow and learn and be with her friends and her counselor friends and everybody's looking out for her and her needs and it's just been, it's just wonderful. It gives Caden a chance to just let his guard down and be himself, not worry about what anybody else thinks, not worry about trying to fit in to the you know normal population. We've been just very, very um, happy to, with, with all the staff, uh, Ari and the, uh, the rest of the teaching staff uh, transitioning his IEP, his individual education plan from his uh, school. I think the other thing with Cole is he has a real camp experience here, just like any other uh, child. And that's another great thing that Camp Lemar does is really provides that real camping experience uh, for Cole. Uh, it's been a remarkably warm and compassionate place, a significant amount of shared affection and compassion being delivered to the campers. Uh. The staff here is, I mean, it's, ob it's obvious when you come that everybody's here for the right reasons. Yes, definitely. To help, to help the kids yeah. rather than just a, a job and a paycheck. The counselors give all the campers the opportunity to be as independent as possible, but also when help is needed, then help is given. Every year he heads off to camp and we usually identify a couple of issues that he's ready to work on. And wouldn't you know it, every summer he grows exponentially, much more than we could have dreamed. Yeah. She's most importantly just very happy and she wears her emotions on her sleeve, so to speak, and she seems very happy and comfortable here right from the first summer she got here. And every year for like mm. the last five summers, uh, progress, 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 sitting at the table, using his utensils, um, being able to take a shower, not a bath, a shower, um, little things like that, as you know, most of you parents know, I mean, celebrations mm. of every little thing that we can for our kids. You know, I took my leap of faith and I said, you know, this camp has been um, successful for so many years. There's so many returning campers that they must be doing something right. We took a leap of faith. They said I went the first year and I waited at home for about seven weeks for someone to call me and tell me that my daughter needed me to pick her up. And I never got the phone call. And we've been coming back ever since. lemar has been just really, really a godsend. We're so happy. And so I would, I would encourage any parents who are anxious or are worried about the transitioning their child from home to a summer camp session, especially like Camp Lemar here, six and a half or seven weeks in the summer. Look at this for their sake. Um, what will they grow from this? I think from a parent's perspective as well, mm -hmm. they need some respite care. They need to be able to rebond as a couple, um, as mm -hmm. the rest of the family. Family's resources have gone into such tremendous effort caring for their special needs child that Camp Lemar is a wonderful place to be. And um, I would highly encourage parents to bring their children here, visit the camp, so I feel really blessed to have them in my lives, and more importantly, I feel uh, really lucky for Cole. I can't say enough. I really 
it's it's an amazing special place and we are very lucky to have found it i think you'll find as we have found marissa and i have found uh, mm -hmm. it's been a wonderful place for joey we're going to bring him back for, for continual years um, yeah until until he's <laughs> uh ages out i mean i wish they had camp for 30 year olds but um we're just going to take what we can um and we're happy that lemar's lemar's been here for us for the past five summers